I just want to show a couple little details about the way we do some trims. Sometimes we take these things for granted, but I think you'd appreciate them. So just, you can use metal brackets on shelving. This shelving has a face on it. That's another nice detail that we do on a lot of clients. And then we use a, a custom built bracket so that it's all wood, it's painted, it looks rich, it looks thick, instead of just a little metal L bracket. Now, some, some, sometimes you have to do it for budget, but these are not too expensive. We do them on most of our projects this way. And as you can see right now, it's getting all primered. We prime it all first, and then we putty all the holes, then go back with two coats of enamel. That's another, another detail that we insist on. We love the, the sliding bypass doors that, uh, that slide beside each other. Really good heavy-duty hardware here. And one more detail I want to show you is in this trim. This trim right here, you can see where we have, a, it's going to be an outlet here. And instead of just cutting the trim with a hole and putting the outlet in there, notice what we'd, we've done. We've cut this into one, two, three, four, five pieces. This, these pieces being long, and one, two, three small ones that are segmented in here. Uh, you'll, you don't usually see this kind of detail in modest home improvements, but this is the kind of detail we put on all of our projects. With, rather than in these situations, than going through and trying to fit a plug right in this little small area, it just doesn't work. And it looks great to have them vertical, but it needs to be done this way. What's also required is that all of this wood be sanded and be evened out because they have to be nailed together a certain way and pinned together and then put in there as one piece and then they're sanded just a little finished sanding on it. But that's, that's a beautiful detail. And that's what we do at KM Builders.